Hey everyone! So um, tomorrow is my first day back at school. I'm so excited to be going back. I had like two-ish weeks off because I had my exams one week and then I had yeah two weeks off after that. I've been working full-time again for these two weeks and I've just been like bah! I got so sick. I've had a horrible horrible cough. So it's just, it hasn't really been a fun break. My one friend from school, she got to go to Mexico, another girl got to go to Hawaii, and I was stuck working the whole time. So, but I'm so excited to be going back to school tomorrow. I'm so excited to see all my friends again. And I just found out that my favorite teacher who taught me medical terminology is going to be teaching another class this semester. So I'm so excited. So let's pack my backpack, because I need my backpack. So this is my... This is my backpack. It's not fancy or anything. Um, it is a Jan Sport backpack. The reason I love it and I use it compared to, you know, like a fancy pink backpack or something, or I have like a cute little Mickey Mouse backpack. The reason I choose to use this instead is it has a gazillion and five compartments and it's just awesome like there's a little compartment right here at the top where I just keep my gum and my lip chap in there so you know during class I'm just like yes I'm paying attention during class all right it has so many compartments it is so great I've actually used this in grade 10 and grade 11 of high school and then in grade 12 I got a new backpack I don't know why, I just decided I wanted something new. And I still went back to this guy for college. So this is my backpack, let's pack it up. So my classes I'm taking this semester are, I'm totally blanking right now. Um, introduction to unit coordinating skills, business communication, processing medical orders, hospital information systems, and medical terminology too. Tomorrow is my first day, and tomorrow I have introduction to hospital unit, introduction to unit coordinating skills. I'm gonna prepare my backpack for that class, as well as just general stuff I need. By the way, totally ignore the fact that I look like death, and I sound like death. I'm still kind of sick, I still kind of have a cough, and because of my cough, when I cough really, really hard, it literally makes me like tear up. So there's no point in wearing makeup these days because it just, yeah. So first thing I'm gonna put in is obviously my wallet. I got a text. Just, you know, gotta have my license on me. Where is my student ID? I put that in here. I put my student ID in here because I went shopping. There it is. Aren't I gorgeous? I actually keep it on a, I actually, I am popular. I actually keep it on a lanyard for school, but I put it in my wallet because I went shopping, um, and certain places you get a discount if you're a student, but they're like, we need to see your ID, please, man. So I put it in my wallet for that. So here's my lanyard that I keep my ID on in. I got this little case at orientation with a flash drive, so. I keep that. I keep all my school stuff on this thing and my lanyard. It just says Bow Valley College. So put my identification in there. Well, it really doesn't matter. I never wear it anyway. No, I got to have it on me if I'm in the library. What not? Along with my EOS lip gloss and a pack of gum, I'm putting my lanyard in this first little top compartment so it's easy access. Like I said, I really don't wear it. So if I'm at the library, or even randomly, you'll get a security guard who thinks he's all tough, and he's like, hey, what are you doing here sitting in the cafeteria? I'm a student here, sir, and you just even pull it out. I'm going to check those texts. Oh, what's from a girl from school? Hey! She says, want to meet up in the cafeteria in the morning. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Anywho, back to my backpack. What should I do next? Okay, so this is... A little notebook I got at Walmart. It has a fox on it because I love foxes. If you saw me looking at it, it's because I have my schedule all written up on it. I have like written my books I've bought. Um, whoa! That's like nine texts right there. Anyway, it's like a planning book. Like it has all my school stuff on it. It has like stuff for payments I need to make. And then also um, I'm planning a trip 
in some time coming up so I have like planning in there for that trip. I don't use it on a daily basis but like if I don't have it and I need it I'm like ah! I definitely did not put my wallet in my backpack. I'm gonna throw on my glasses. Actually I never really use this. Never mind I'm not gonna throw this in there. It's gonna go there. First like two things in my backpack are things that have nothing to do with school. Nothing I really even need. Look at me. So on that note, let's actually put something in my backpack that is relevant to school. So this is my hedgehog binder. Got it at Walmart. And so in here I put my module for introductory to unit coordinating skills. And this is basically everything we will be studying in this class. So I have this class tomorrow, so obviously I need that. I don't even know what we'll be doing. It's the first day of classes, they might be, welcome to the classroom, everyone stand up and tell us four interesting facts about yourself. And I'll stand up there and be like, hello everyone, I know you all from last semester, so yeah. So this is my little file folder type crap. Um, I just keep loose papers in here. I actually don't keep very much in here anymore. Lots of the times my teachers would hand out papers that didn't have holes in them, so lots of them would go in here. But I solved that problem with my next thing I need to put in my thing, which is a hole punch. I was so annoyed with having so many papers everywhere, and every time I'd be studying, I'd be like, wait, I need my notes from this one class, and it'd be in my folder, and it's like, hey, can they all just be together? So I actually went to Walmart and purchased a hole punch. You know what? It, it was a good investment and this thing has saved me, not saved me, but like kept my notes so organized. And I'm a very organized person. I don't like my note. I don't like notes from one class being here as well as here. And the notes here are combined with other notes from like 17 other classes. I, not happening. Oh, hole puncher, $2. Good investment. I'm throwing in a phone charger. This is breaking. This is breaking so bad. I've taped it with scotch tape. This is for obviously those days my phone does not last me all day. So yeah, phone charger. As well as just some sticky notes. Cause sticky notes. Oh, and my small sticky notes. I bought these at the dollar store and they're so tiny and adorable. So they are coming as well. Have my um a notebook that I used for my first semester for organizational behavior and I didn't even use half of it so I'm going to use the other half for business communication and then I also have my com my business communication textbook I bought as you can see it is still in the plastic because I barely used any of the textbooks I bought last semester so I figured I'm gonna wait and see if we use this and if we do I'll open it if we don't I will return it and get my money back that I spent on this. These puppies are expensive. I don't really know if I'll need these because I don't have this class tomorrow, but I'm such a like, better be safe than sorry type person. I, I know I don't have this class, so what's the point? I'm going to leave it home. Other school things I'm leaving at home, uh, my another module for another class. Um, I left one of my binders in my locker, so that's the binder that this is going to go in. And then in my pink binder, I have processing medical orders. So again, I don't have this class tomorrow, so staying home. And two more things. School things, not bringing. My binder for medical terminology. I still have my all my modules for medical terminology one. So I figured I would just keep it all together. So I'm going to be putting medical terminology two in here. Then my language of medicine textbook, which is the textbook I will be using for processing medical orders and medical terminology too. Look how big it is. It is so heavy, but it is so good. It's just like such an interesting textbook if you're like interested in the medical junk. If you want to see some yummy pictures, let me know. I'll, I'll show you some yummy pictures. So, intestine, stomach, those are teeth, two different colored feet, lots of words. Um, whoa, what is that? Tonsillitis, that's what that is. <laughs> I had that. Fun fact, I got my tonsils out when I was seven. I don't know if you can see, uh, you can't see. Um, yeah, there's no sheets on my bed. I'm currently cleaning my room, um, but my 
dry, my sheets are in the dryer because I've been so sick that, you know, my sheets are probably kind of nasty. So, um, my sheets are in the dryer right now, so I will be finishing cleaning my room in like, probably like an hour-ish when they're done. So that's why I have no sheets on my bed. You can't even see though. So, ignore that statement. Of course, this comes with me literally everywhere. This is my agenda. There is no undorky way to say this. Agenda. Day planner. Hmm. But this is my like absolute everything. I write everything in this book. For tomorrow, I wrote actually like the exact classroom they're in because I it's a new class. I don't know where to go. So I wrote like what classroom they're in. Eventually by next week, I'll know where to go. I write when I work. I write even today it says get school stuff ready get Walmart stuff to return see this is my bag of stuff I need to return at Walmart yes it's in a Home Depot bag I work at Home Depot I steal the bags from there on this day I bought my bus pass on this day I went to Boston Pizza with my family on this day I got my hair done I write everything oh highlighted that means it's an exam so that that was my exam week I cannot focus right now study for exams went to Original Joe's that night not just my homework everything so this book literally comes with me everywhere this absolutely right in there I need to blow my nose this is just like a little makeup case I got from forever 21 so it says love bites on it but I mostly got it because it has sharks on it because I love sharks there is definitely a granola bar in here oh my <laughs> that just made my day um so I just keep generic things in here. I have spray for my glasses. That's almost empty. A uh, hand cream. Some lady product. Band-aids. A mirror. You know, I'm a horrible mess. Extra bobby pins. A little mascara. Um, if I wear like lip gloss or um, lipstick, I'll put that in here too so I can touch up during the day. I'll often also put like powder in it so I can touch on my powder during the day. So yeah, that's what's in here. Um, I'm not gonna put it in my backpack right now because I do wanna put in like the lipstick or whatever I wear. Um, once I put it on in the morning, I'll put it in here. Put it here for now. Along with the fact that I have my crazy agenda, I also have this little notebook guy. And this is literally a book of lists. That's it. But I literally like document everything in here. Three. Sorry. Um, not document. I literally write down everything in here that like needs to be done or I need to buy. So even today, I made a list of stuff to do today. Buy a bus pass, but I did that on Saturday, so I'm good. Um, bring laundry downstairs. Put Florida Georgia Line CD in car. Get school stuff ready. Uh, get Walmart stuff ready. See, double thing. I wrote that in both my agenda and in here. Um, clean room, uh, wash bed sheets, and of course, film a video. This comes with me everywhere again, because you never know when you're like, oh, I need to do this when I get home. Or you never know when a scrapbooking idea is going to hit you, and you're like, I need to write down that idea to scrapbook. And then, of course, my pencil case. Uh, this is something I've had since high school, because I'm such a loser, but... This is my Jack Sparrow pencil case. I love Pirates of the Caribbean. Loved it back in high school, still do. And you know what, it still works. I even wrote my name on the side. I keep so much in here. There are kids in my class who bring a pencil and a pen and I'm like, dude, what if you need an eraser? Or whiteout, a pink highlighter, or, or a green pen, a ruler. I got this from work and it folds. The thing is, if I don't have this, like, if I were to just bring a pencil and a pen to school, I would be like, I can't do this. Like, I just have, like, my system of how I do everything. And certain ne things need to be written with my purple pen. And certain things need to be highlighted in blue. While other things need to be highlighted in yellow. So I am just so OCD and so crazy when it comes to things like this. So this needs to come with me. Like, we're all done packing up my backpack for school tomorrow. Oh, you know what I need to put in here? Headphones. I'm pretty much done. That's what I have in here. And I am ready to go to school in the morning. All right, let's put on our backpacks. 
and go. Thank you so much for watching this video. Um, I'm sorry if my voice has been absolutely horrendous the entire time. I'm so like, ugh. I had to run away to cough at one point, like it was just like bleh. So anyway, I hope you guys liked this video. Please subscribe if you liked it and would like to see more. Follow me on Instagram, it is jody.s. I hope you guys are having a great day and I can't wait to go to school tomorrow. I know you guys are all enjoying, getting ready to enjoy summer break, but I'm going back to school. I'm so excited. I don't even, like, it doesn't even bother me that it's during the summer. I'm just so excited to be going back to school and just, ah, I even know what I'm going to wear tomorrow. And I'm so excited. Okay, bye everybody.